Hello, everybody. Welcome to another video by us at uh, DM North. It is uh, myself, Jordo, here. And again, I'm joined by Reg. Say hello, Reg. Hello. <laughs> um, oh, yeah. And today, uh, uh, the, the topic has come up. I've seen a lot of new players kind of pop up on Facebook and Discord and places and just kind of asking about how to play and whatnot. So, I mean, everyone's kind of got the idea of, of what to do and how to do it. Um, but we kind of wanted to review some options, especially with uh, with the pandemic the way it was and, and webcams being more difficult to come across. Um, some people just couldn't get a hold of them. So we, what uh, we did was uh, we were able to uh, get a hold of some options here and we wanted to kind of talk about some currently some webcam options for Dice Masters in particular. Um, so what we've got here is... Uh, well, let's talk about this guy first of all. Um, this is the guy everyone know we know and love. It is the Logitech C920. Um, probably the majority of Dice Masters players use this camera. Um, is that what you use, Reg? Or I have a C20. I actually have two of the the C920s. And okay. Yeah, I was lucky to get my hands on a few. But yeah, yeah I, I think I've had mine for a few. It feels like a few years now, um, yeah. but. Uh, I, I guess they're during the early stages of the pandemic, this was nowhere to be found. Um, but let's talk about why, why do we like it? Um, the, the best, uh, the big reasons are it's easy to use. It's plug and play, stick it in. It's relatively cheap. That that's going to have an asterisk on it right now and widely available. That's also going to have an asterisk on it. Uh, cause normally it's easy to find again with the pandemic, the way the world is right now, it hasn't been as easy to find, but I've noticed it's kind of shown up in uh, in stock on Amazon, uh, at least for the Canadians. I don't know about the rest of the world. Uh, but let's take a look. This was uh, taken as of the day of recording this video. Um, the Logitech C920 right now on Amazon.ca is 132 or 169 So is that cheap? I don't, I don't know. I feel I got a better deal on it when I bought mine, but... Again, I bought mine a few years yeah. ago. I think, I think that's the thing too is that these prices have gone up due to the pandemic. I know yeah. I bought my second Logitech last Christmas, and it was a hundred dollars. So just to yeah. compare, it's gone up already. I mean, it does go on sale at times, and yeah, and, and you can pick up at any electronic stores. But yeah, the price has gone up obviously because of the pandemic. Yeah. So, um, it's so still a good deal. It's still a good deal. I mean, if you could find it, get it. Um, it's it's a great camera. Um, but what if there was another option? So we've all got these devices uh, on us. I think everyone's got some type of a smartphone. Um, so what if uh, these all these phones have cameras on them? So what if we could use the camera on the phones as a web camera? Uh, so that's kind of what we've done. We've kind of done some testing on, uh, on the cameras um, to see what they look like. So what I'm going to say here is uh, a huge disclaimer. Um, this uh, software that, or the app that I'm using to test this is not available for Android. So if you are an Android user, you'll either have to find an alternative to what I'm going to show you or uh, just stick with the C920. Uh, so you Android users, you can stop watching now. iPhone users, yeah, th thanks for watching. Uh, give us a like and a <laughs> <I'm> subscribe. <out>. <laughs> 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 but if it, if it gives another option and we'll I see mean... we'll see you next time um so let's <laughs> for the iphone users carry on let's continue um, so the apple iphone um again it kind of falls in the same things it's easy to use um it's it's very simple it's relatively cheap now let me say that yeah iphones themselves are not cheap if you're <laughs> buying one straight up but the majority of people get them with their plans it's built into the cost of what you're paying for um, you can get used ones probably pretty inexpensively on Kijiji and places like that. Um, widely available, they're all over the place. Like I, the the one I'm actually using for this test is I think it's one of my kids or wife, one of them, their old phone, because it was just sitting in a drawer. I said, hey, let's see if this works. Um, so if you got which one is it that you were using? I am using the, the iPhone Seven. I think it is is the one I've got. I'm the using Seven. Okay. Yeah, I think they're up to like. 52 now or whatever they're at now but yeah yeah um, i think the iphone yeah, the, the triple x is coming out uh next year so um i mean i know yeah. a big thing with the apples is they've got a good camera right? yeah they do have so good they've cameras. always got good cameras got on good them cameras. so like i said this is everything we've tested on or i've tested on here has been the iphone 7 um 
I'm sure the lower models might work, um, but I didn't have one available to me. So um, how are we doing this? We are looking at a software from Elgato. Um, this is the link. I'll include it in the link to the uh, underneath the video in the description. Um, but the software is called Epoch Cam. Um, it's an app you run on your phone, and it basically turns your phone's camera into a webcam, and you can communicate with your computer very easily. I'm not going to go into the details of how to set it up. I'll actually try to include a link. If I figured it out, there should be a card appearing right now linking you to that video. If I haven't figured it out, it's going to be in the description below here. Uh, but yeah, Elgato is where you're going to want to go. Uh, so, um, what are we doing here? We're going to compare, obviously, the C920 to the Epoch Cam straight up. And we're going to be looking at it in two... Uh, environments. We're going to look under Google Hangouts, which is what probably the majority of people use to play Dice Masters online. And we're also going to look at it under Jitsi. Uh, Jitsi's, it's very similar to Hangouts, um, but it's got some things, if you're a content creator, it's got some tools built into it that makes it a little easier to record. But we figured, because these are kind of the big two, um, we'd kind of take a look at both cameras in both environments and kind of see how they look and how they function and go from there. Um, that sound good to you, Reg? Sounds good. I know the the Google Hangouts is what we've been using for I, I'd say going back at least what two three years playing oh God, Dice Masters forever. And the the Jitsi was one of the good things I think in 2020 that we started using was uh, that came out and we were like, what is this? And we you know it took a week to get used to it, but a lot of people like using the Jitsi rooms. I find, yeah. um, and and again, I think the other part that we always hear is that Hangouts is going to be going away. They say. They Every keep time. saying that, so, so what? eventually we're not going to have Hangouts, but right now we do, so we are going to test it out here. Um, well, I'm also going to preface yeah. that these uh, tests, Reg helped me out with this. So all of the footage we're going to show you came from Reg's side. I was broadcasting my my play mat, my dice, to him, and he sent me the video, and then I, I, I took the screenshots of it. So everything you're seeing is what he saw. Right? right? Okay. So first, we're going to look yes. at the Logitech C920. We're going to check it out under Hangouts. And this is what the majority of us are used to seeing. Um, you see most of the play mat. You rarely get to see everything. Um, but you see the important parts. Uh, the dice are there. You can't really tell what they are. I mean, you can tell what they are, but you can't really see stats or anything like that. Um, but I'd say this is what most of us see when we're playing Dice Masters. Would you agree? On a standard game, yes. Yeah. It usually cuts off the left and right. Um, and if you go up higher, you're losing even more uh, checking out the stats. But yeah. Yeah, that's, so that's, that's, that's what we're all used to. Um, so let's look at the exact same setup, but we're going to take a look at it under Jitsi. And instantly you can kind of see things are a little bit crisper, a little bit clearer. Um, otherwise, it's it's kind of a very similar image, right? Correct. I mean, yeah, it is. It looks a little clearer using the same webcam. So, yeah. same input from your PC. So, yeah. Um, yeah. But I mean, again, you can see everything. Same kind of picture image. Yeah. So, let's just take looks a look fine. at this uh, kind of side by side because it's hard to kind of jump back and forth. So, you can look again Logitech C920 on the left hand side. You've got the Hangouts on the right hand side. You got the Jitsi and just eyeballing it. Um, I'm looking at Hal Jordan here um, for my comparison. And Hal Jordan is like, pretty clear he's pretty crisp clear. on the right side um even the stats are yeah. a little easier to read uh, i mean there's a little glare on there but i mean i look at iron not iron heart who is that no iron heart that's right no that's the other guy uh oh my god i forgot his name <laughs> iron lad i'm not a war of light guy no that's iron lad isn't it <laughs> yes uh okay not iron. his his stats iron lad? i think that's iron lad his stats are pretty clear you can see the two. Oh, yeah. Things. That's on the die. Yes, yeah. Yes. Um, then I look on the other side and like She-Hulk and Groot and Thanos. I don't know what they, what stats they are. I can tell what they are, <laughs> but that's about it. Yeah. Um, so just quick note there. Jitsi is a little bit clearer with the C920. Um, but let's uh, see what the Epoch cam looks like. So again, this is an iPhone 7 and this is Hangouts. Um, first thing I notice with this picture is you see everything. Like the field of view is bigger, and the the heights were very similar. Let me let me add that too. I tried to make sure that everything was kind of working in the same uh, the same setup here. You had the same kind of height, yeah, from the yeah. tripod that you had it on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you can 
you can see like just normally you have the the ghost rider on the left side there you'd have the number cut off in the um the other camera it looked like yeah um and that's the first thing we noticed when we went to this this kind of view yeah so you can you can see more but again I, the stats you can't really see um everything's kind of same old same old um so again we're going to take the yeah. same camera we're going to jump it over to jitsi and that's pretty good <laughs> Like, pretty clear and this is what you saw this isn't what i showed you this is i'm oh, sorry this is what what i saw this is what you this saw what I recorded yeah. yeah so this yeah. is transmitted across canada so uh coast to coast uh well not quite coast to coast <laughs> close enough <laughs> yeah close enough close enough um but you can see a lot you can see the full field of view and you can actually read numbers on the dice which is quite nice um so this was uh yeah this was the Epoch Cam in Jitsi. So, again, let's do the side by side comparison here, and there's no comparison between the two of these. Like it's it's night and day. You got uh, you got the the Hangouts on the on the left hand side, which looks okay, but then you see it on the. Mm -hmm. Did I say right or left? Anyway, you see on Hangouts the left, on the left. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Jitsi on the right. <laughs> Hangers on the left. Jitsi on the right. A little icon. Do you see them? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The blue. Go on the blue side. Looks amazing. Okay. Uh, so yeah. we've decided Jitsi looks best. So let's take the both cameras, throw them in Jitsi, and let's do a, a side by side of those guys. So this is all Jitsi, and this is um, the C920 on the left, Epoch Cam on the right. Um, both are pretty decent pictures, but. I don't know. To me, hands down, the the Epoch cam looks better, right? Yeah, the, the Epoch looks clear. You can see again. We were talking about the cutoff. You can see how the Ghost Rider is cut off on that one side. You can just see how it looks like it's it's stretched. Yeah. Um, the Epoch, by by all means, when we saw that, we were like, wow, we were really uh, impressed with how that was clear the yeah. quality. Um. So that's our test. So let's talk about what are our conclusions. Um. So between uh, Jitsi and Hangouts, I think we give our, our gold star to Jitsi, right? Overall. Yes. Now, having said that, J Jitsi is not always simple. <laughs> um, can we... th there's, there can be issues with it. When it doesn't want to work, it is, it is a headache beyond belief. But when it does work, yeah, it's, it's fantastic. So... Um, I try as much as I can to play with Jitsi, um, but it doesn't always work out. Depends on what part of the world you're in. Depends on time of day. Um, when it works, it works fantastic. So if you can use it, yeah, I some some players have said, yeah, yeah. I'd say if you can if you use, can it, use it, it, use it. Use it. Um, if you can't, stick with Hangouts. Stick with Discord. Um, stick with Skype. Whatever is working for you, use it. Um, I didn't, we didn't, obviously didn't test everything, but these we just stick with the kind of the big ones. Um, Hangouts, like I said, the right. only caveat is we're going to lose it. We just don't know when. Uh, yeah. And so. I think some pl some players have troubles with uh, the Jitsi rooms. And I know in, in our site, we have both uh, from our game rooms that we have that you yeah. can play in. We actually have links to both Jitsi and to Hangout rooms. Yeah, so, originally I, I um, kind of... Use whatever one's there. Yeah, I put it originally just to all Jitsi just because I liked it better. But then I heard enough kind of complaints. So I think we've got two official Hangout rooms. Um, we can certainly create some more if necessary. Um, so I guess if that's feedback, if we want more, we can make more. But uh, right now, we're, we're kind of backing Team Jitsi. Uh, yes. Our next thing is between the two cameras, I think there was really no comparison, right? Like, mm -hmm. I think we're, again, giving our gold star to uh, the iPhone. Um, again, the software just made use of... Uh, the, the camera in that phone is way better than the camera in the, the Logitech. And the fact that they've got the software working to do that, it just makes it, it's, it's a fantastic webcam. Like you, you're not going to get a, a higher quality webcam at this price point. Yep. Right. It was solid. Yeah. Um, so I think uh, basically what we're saying is if you don't have access to a webcam, um, Try some of this webcam software. Now, um, like I said, this is the Elgato software. There is a paid and a free version, and I can't re really remember what the difference between the two of them was. I think it's just one of them will go to 720, and the other one will go to 1080. 
720 is probably fine for Dice Master, so the free one probably works. There are a ton of other softwares like this one. Um, the reason I kind of test out the Elgato one is Elgato, they know their streaming stuff. They know their that kind of stuff. So that's that's why I like that company. Um, and their stuff, for the most part, just works. Uh, I think that's kind of all I want to add there. Uh, by all means, use the C920 if you have it. It's a good camera. It's, we're not saying it's a piece of crap. Um, but yep. if you have an, an old iPhone lying around or you can you can mount your iPhone easily and you don't have access to any other webcams, use it. This is, You'll get online real quick with this, okay? It'd be, it'd be interesting, too, if people want to put in the comments down below of what, what camera you use because maybe there's others that might spark someone else to, you know, if the C920 is out and you can't buy yourself an iPhone, well, let's see what's uh, what other people are using. And by all means, we can probably uh, do an article up for this and show the other options too. Yeah, if, and for the, know, as long uh, as you have something better. Than- and for the Android users, I, if if there is an option similar to this for you, um, let us know. Um, I I just don't know about it right now because I I'm not an Android user. Um, and as of right now, the Epoch Cam does not work on on Android. I'm sure it'll come eventually, but they're just they've kind of thrown their uh, their hat in the iPhone ring. Uh, so I think that mm-hmm. kind of covers everything we wanted to talk about there. Um, like Reg said, if you, uh, let us know what you're using for webcams. Um, let us know in the comments below. Are you using the C920? Are you using something else and you find it really good? Tell us what it is. Um, if you don't have a webcam and you want to get into Dice Masters and you're trying out your phone, is it working for you? Which software are you using if you don't have the iPhone? Um, did you use the Epoch cam? Did you try something else? Um, we'd love to hear from you. Um, so this is the obligatory, thank you for watching. We really appreciate you hanging out for the whole video. Um, if you're not already doing so, if you don't mind giving us a like and a subscribe, we, we sure do appreciate it. Uh, if you want to follow us on any of the social medias, we are, we are now rebranded as DM North TV. Um, that was just to kind of bring us all under one umbrella. So under Instagram, Twitter, uh, YouTube, Facebook, Twitch, you'll find us there. Uh, on Twitch, we are broadcasting a little more regularly. Uh, kind of variety of gameplay options there, not just Dice Masters. Um, give us a follow there. We'd sure like it. Uh, I think that's all I want to kind of throw at people. Is there anything you wanted to add there, Reg? No, I mean, I know you're you're the uh, the boss here for the DM North, but I mean, again, you said to people, if they're having troubles setting up a camera, you know, getting the camera working for gameplay, you know you can reach out to us with a comment and one of us will reach out to you from either to Discord or even the comments on this video. And, uh, you know, we'll take the time to, to help you get it set up. I'm sure lots of people can comment down below uh, that one of us have helped you eventually, you know, getting the games working because we do want you online watching with us. So uh, come on out and join us. Okay. Again, thanks for watching, everyone, and uh, take care.